Have you ever spent time pondering the Diomede Islands? Situated in the Bering Strait between Alaska and Russia, these islands are a geographical marvel. They're only 2.4 miles apart, yet a thin line of 24 hours separates them. A captivating phenomenon, where a mere thread of earth and sea splits Big Big Diomede Island in Russia, and Little Diomede Island in the USA, apart by an entire day. This line of demarcation introduces us to the fascinating concept of the International Dateline, leading to intriguing nicknames for the islands, Tomorrow Island, and Yesterday Isle. Perhaps you've come across this term during your exploration of time and geography. The International Dateline is something most of us are familiar with, but only a handful can truly grasp essence. Today, we aim to change this. Prepare yourself as we embark on a journey to the mysterious Diomede Islands, deciphering the riddles of the International Dateline, breaking down its intricate details, and making it comprehensible for all. Today, we dive into the enthralling world of the Diomede Islands and the International Dateline. Get ready to unlock its mysteries. Imagine a world without a set standard for time and date. It's a nightmare, don't you think? It'd be a reality of disarray, confusion, and pandemonium. There would be no uniformity, no order, no amid this hypothetical bedlam comes our savior. The international dateline. This concept, a brainchild of dire need, serves our beautiful planet as an unseen yet powerful timekeeper. This unseen longitudinal line, which stretches its arms from the frosty North Pole to the icy South Pole, stands as the sentinel marking the commencement of each fresh new day. It's the line where dawn is born, where each new day takes its first breath. At the stroke of midnight, when the clock hands a line, the first location on Earth to welcome the new day is found just to the west of the International Date Line. As the Earth, our home, continues its relentless pirouette on its axis, this new day, a symbol of endless possibilities and fresh beginnings, unfurls its magic from one end of the globe to the other, tracing its path from east to west. This fascinating phenomenon, a dance as old as time itself, unfolds in a captivating sweep across our planet's face. Yet among this grand spectacle of celestial mechanics, there exists a curious anomaly, a question that teases the minds the curious and the scholarly alike. But have you ever wondered what truly occurs when you traverse the perplexing boundary known as the International Dateline? Well, if you travel west across the line, you add 24 hours or a full day to your clock. This concept may seem intriguing, and indeed it is. It's an essential quotient of international timekeeping that has been in effect since 1884. The addition of these hours isn't merely an arbitrary but rather a carefully calculated system that takes into account the Earth's rotation and the various time zones that divide our globe. Similarly, the reverse applies when you venture in the eastern direction. The dynamics stay the same, but instead of adding, you subtract the same amount of time, effectively balancing out the equation. This intricate system of timekeeping doesn't mean you're literally propelling through time, it's simply a methodical way to ensure every part of our vast planet simultaneously experiences the same date. It might sound like you're time traveling, but this adjustment ensures that the whole planet is on the same page, or rather, the same day. However, the international dateline is not as straight as it sounds. This seemingly invisible demarcation has a fascinating trajectory. It meanders around political realms and national boundaries, including Russia and numerous Pacific Island nations. This complex path is not a coincidence but a consequence of global cooperation and diplomacy. These deviations are a consequence of intricate accords and meetings, purposely designed to circumvent any potential confusion concerning dates within a specific national boundary or territory. These deviations are a result of international agreements and conventions, designed to prevent confusion over dates within a single country or territory. In essence, the International Dateline is an imaginary marking that decides when and where a new day emerges. This line, although not visible, plays a monumental role in our understanding of time. Its existence allows us to ascertain what day it is, regardless of our whereabouts in the world. Imagine crossing this line, you either gain or lose a day depending on your travel direction. A fascinating concept, isn't it? The line may not be geometrically straight, but it nonetheless serves an essential role. It ensures the synchronicity of our global timekeeping system, thereby warding off the potential pandemonium of temporal disorder. So, the next time you cross a time zone or marvel at the synchronization of global time, remember the international dateline. 
Have you ever considered its significance? This geographical meridian holds an extraordinary role. It's more than just a simple line on our globes. It is the thin, invisible thread that connects us all, making sure that our world runs like a well-oiled machine. Its role cannot be understated as it upholds a complex system of timekeeping, which is crucial for the coordination of our everyday activities all over the globe. This line, quite literally, links the past to the future. It is fascinating how it is able to keep everything in harmony, from the trading markets on Wall Street to a farmer's daily routine in the heartland of China. This line is an unsung hero that ensures the smooth functioning of our global calendar. Did you know that the international dateline has some interesting quirks? Let's take a look at the Diomede Islands, located in the Bering Strait between Alaska and Russia. These two islands are only about 2.4 miles apart, but they are separated by the international dateline. This means that when it's Saturday on Little Diomede Island, USA, it's already Sunday on Big Diomede Island, Russia. This fascinating phenomenon has led to the nicknames Tomorrow Island for Big Diomede and Yesterday Isle for Little Diomede. So while you can see tomorrow from Little Diomede, you'll still have to wait 24 hours to actually get there. The international dateline once again shows its peculiar and intriguing influence on our perception of time.